The thing about A-man football, if they put the action key, which is the first defensive lineman inside the read, at a 2 2 or one technique with a play side mic, the guard has to make an ace-plus, ace-plus, ace-plus call. Why? Because in eight-man football, the end can't veer inside to protect the B-gap because if one takes the dive and they run the mic over the top, they got you three on three. So the ace-plus call provides the double team with the center and the guard on the two technique. So the guard will put his left knee in the crotch, left hand to the stomach, toes north, the center snaps the ball, then puts his right knee in the crotch, right hand to the stomach, toes north. The backside guard and end sprint their belly button to the hip of the adjacent offensive lineman. The ace plus call has the end take three flat steps, step at 45 degrees, and then put his left knee in the crotch, left hand to the stomach, toes north on number two. The quarterback now, his process is different because there's no one to protect the B-gap, so now it's, a, it's going to be a pull read. So what's going to happen is the quarterback's going to take the snap, jump in the gap, he's going to point the ball. The B-back's going to run his path through, and hey, if the mic tackles him, that's great. The quarterback's going to replace and score, and if number one is standing there, the quarterback's going to hit the brakes and flick the ball to the A-back coming around. Most of the time, that's what happens in eight-man football. Is number one is just going to stand there, and you're going to get the ball kicked on the corner, which is a beautiful thing. Because the average football team that pitches the ball gets 220% more yards on a triple option than if they give it to the B-back. So you want to get the ball kicked, and they provide that situation for you. So in an ace-plus call, the quarterback's going to pull the ball, and if number one is standing there, or he attacks the quarterback, the quarterback hits the brakes and flicks it to the A-back coming around. The cadence is down, ready, set hot. On the wine ready, he hammers, takes two diagonal steps, turns up, and he is ready for the ball. Because if number one steps to the quarterback, quarterback hits the brakes, flicks it across his peck to the A-back, and then you get this block, you're out the gate. And that's the beauty of uh, when teams give you a 4-2 in eight-man football, when they give you an action key with a play side mic. It puts you in that situation. All right, coaches, if you're looking to install the triple option offense for eight-man, give me a call, 570-332-0265, 570-332-0265 with the triple option football academy for eight-man and triple option football academy camps. You're going to learn how to run the triple option offense, the Army, Navy, Paul Johnson way for eight-man. There's a three-step eight-man clinic. There's a 216-rep eight-man script. It takes a couple days to install and you don't even have to do anything. You just show the players where to go, and they go. I do a webinar with you and your staff. I'm on call 24 hours a day. There's videos of my eight-man clients running the offense, game video, and camp video. Lots of camp video. Lots and lots of camp video. So give me a call. You'll be doing this the right way the first time, and I'll see you in the next video. Talk then.